the most terrifying roller coaster at Crystal Beach. The Coney Island Cyclone. The roller coaster that caused up to at least three deaths starting with the worst. On May 26, 1985, a 29-year-old man was killed when he stood up and hit his head on a crossbeam he died instantly. On August 23, 1988, a 26-year-old maintenance worker was killed after falling from the coaster. The man was the only passenger in the back seat during his lunch break. Apparently avoiding the safety bar, he was seen standing up as the train began its descent down the first hill. He fell 30 feet, 9.1 m, landed on a crossbeam of a lower section of track and died instantly. The ride was closed after the incident but reopened a day later after safety inspectors concluded it was safe. Keith Shirasawa, a 53-year-old man suffered several crushed vertebrae in his neck while riding the cyclone on July 31, 2007. He died four days later due to complications during surgery. But there were other incidents that did not end with death on June 12, 2008, a woman rode the cyclone and later claimed that she had been seriously injured due to the ride. She was awarded $1.5 million in damages in 2015, despite being found partly at fault. In March 2018, a man claimed to have been struck by a metal bolt while waiting in the ride queue. The cyclone has been evacuated several times due to mechanical problems. On March 28, 2015, a mechanical failure caused a train to be stuck at the top of the lift hill, no one was injured. On June 13 of that year, a mechanical issue caused the ride to stop completely. The cyclone stalled. Again on July 28, 2018, after it lost power. The Cyclone is a chaotic and thrilling coaster showing just how far you can go with roller coasters and it inspired a book and musical that is loved by the internet the coaster is dangerous but loved. So what is there to do? I know this video is a bit different than others I just needed to write about this I hope you enjoyed the next video will be about. Myths again if you enjoyed this please tell me in the comments.